Incredible Rescue by Medal of Honor recipient U.S. Army's Lt. Larry Taylor. On June 18, 1968, 1st Lt. Larry Taylor distinguished himself above and beyond the call of duty while serving with 4th Cavalry, near the village of Apgo Kong, Vietnam. On this date, Taylor commanded a light fire team of two Cobra helicopter gunships scrambled on a nighttime mission in response to an urgent call for aerial fire support from a four-man long-range patrol team. Upon arrival, Taylor found the patrol team surrounded and heavily engaged by a larger Viet Cong force. He immediately requested illumination rounds from supporting artillery to assist with identifying the enemy positions. Despite intense enemy ground fire, he flew at a perilously low altitude placing a devastating volume of aerial rocket and machine gun fire on the enemy forces encircling the friendly patrol. For approximately 45 minutes, Taylor and his wingmen continued to make low-level, danger-close attack runs on the surrounding enemy positions. When enemy fire increased from the village of Apgo Kong, he requested artillery rounds with lower illumination altitudes be fired on that portion of the village so that the burning rounds ignited the enemy positions. With both Cobra gunships nearly out of ammunition and the enemy still closing in on the patrol team, Taylor flew the patrol team's potential ground evacuation route, finding it to be useless based on the heavy enemy fire encountered. Returning to the patrol team's location, he continued to circle it at a low level under intense enemy fire, employing his searchlight to make fake gun runs on the enemy positions to distract them from the patrol team. Running low on fuel and with the patrol team nearly out of ammunition, Taylor decided to extract the team with his two-man Cobra helicopter gunship, a feat never before accomplished. He directed his wingmen to fire their remaining mini-gun rounds on the patrol team's east flank. Taylor then fired his own last mini-gun rounds on the enemy positions, opening an avenue of movement to the east for the patrol team. He directed the patrol team to move 100 yards towards the extraction point where Taylor, still under enemy fire, landed his helicopter and instructed the patrol team to climb aboard anywhere they could. With the four-man long-range patrol team seated on rocket pods and skids, he evacuated them to the nearest friendly location, undoubtedly saving their lives. God bless our vets.